Uh, I want to talk about. So, good start to the episode. We've had a stench. Yep. <laughs> We've had a, a bit of cleaning. Yep. Uh, we've had the alarm what go off. What food was it, by the way? It was like a stir fry. A stanky stir fry. Stanky Great. stir yeah. fry. Stir fry stench. And <laughs> just before we began the episode, <laughs> we saw the biggest poo of all time. <laughs> yeah, so. In the Keelan. warehouse tour. This place sucks. Now, the only other time <laughs> I've ever seen <laughs> Keelan laugh as hard as I just saw him laugh was at the big cat poo. <laughs> right? <laughs> Which means you, like... George, would the thing you like that to you find it? funniest in the world is ca- is poo, just big poos. Would no, th- I'll explain it. This is what happened. Okay. Oh wait, can I explain what it looks like? I though? looked at it first. <laughs> you will get to that. Yeah, I looked at it first. So hang, went, on, hang on, we went. We all went to the the bathroom. We went for a done run. Yep, went to the done run. As you know, lots of people use this warehouse. There's there's three toilets. It's right? a it's a communal toilet yep. at. A warehouse district. Now, if you're a regular listener of the podcast, yeah. you probably can already guess the state of the toilets here. Worse than the fridge. Yeah, <laughs> it smells heaps worse. Like the stench is yeah. incredible. And it's a, I, I would say that the three of us are the only people here treating that bathroom with respect. And we don't even <laughs> treat it with that much respect. Oh, uh, I try. Yeah, but it's hard to. Like there's not yeah. even like stuff. There's no, there's no toilet brush. So if you miss... Your oh, yeah, there's shit no toilet is just brush. there for like three weeks. I haven't thought of that. I always think, oh, why is it always dirty every time? Yeah. It's because there's no you option. You can't clean it. And they you know clean it on a Friday afternoon. Right. right. So yeah. that's probably the best So we come in poo. here on like a Tuesday or something, yeah. Yeah. do big stinky shit. And well, no, we don't. The warehouse You did one do. yesterday. Huh? You did a shit yesterday. Yeah, but I, the, <laughs> I didn't do a warehouse poo. That's what I'm saying. Huh? I didn't do a warehouse poo. Didn't you? No, I, uh, no, I mean, you can do a poo in the warehouse, but there's a difference between a regular poo and a warehouse work. Oh, yeah, poo. okay. Yeah, That's what I'm right. saying. Yeah. Lewis did a, a, normal, di- I did a normal human, human poo. poo. Yeah, where you'd see, you'd be like, oh, look, a human poo. That's yeah, kind of gross. A warehouse poo? No, I think it's, uh, I, don't, I don't want to be racist, but everyone else here is Russian. So I think it's Russian shit is unbelievable. <laughs> That's a that's a chemical weapon that it's they're so like, known for. It's just potatoes and vodka, clearly. It's <laughs> <laughs> just ruining. Look, okay, that was so... I went into the cubicle and I went, this is my reaction. Oh, dear. Right? And then I walked out. Lewis <laughs> goes, oh, what? Was it that big? And I went, dude, it, w- it was black. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And so then I had to have a look then, and I was like, oh. <clears throat> Yes, that, that was that Very was the, gross. the common reaction. Was, but I, oh. I didn't, I didn't have a look. I had a glance. No. I had a glance. I you didn't glanced. even look all the way in. I went, "Why'd you look?" You go, "I had to." And Lewis Keelan got out the magnifying no. glass. So did he? Keelan go, feels left out and goes, "I want to see the shit." Right? <laughs> comes, out, <laughs> comes out of his cubicle and then doesn't say anything. Just starts howling, laughing. <laughs> <laughs> I've never heard you laugh. More. Why was that funny? Because I, he just looks at a poo and like just starts, starts uncontrollably losing oh, his shit. I don't know what's funny about it. <clears throat> what did it look like? It was, I didn't get a proper look. It was like someone had done a poo, then tried to cover it up with toilet paper, <laughs> and then gone for round two on top. <laughs> was so funny like there's someone's like I think there's someone who lives right next to the toilets and Keelan just starts howling laughing <laughs> at probably that person's shit <laughs> and then I just oh. screamed that's a big poo <laughs> <laughs> he did and you know what I uh, the reason why I didn't look too hard was because I actually saw it yesterday I tried oh. to use it and I saw it there so I flushed it and then the toilet started to flood. I was like, I'm out of here. <laughs> oh, wow. It wasn't Blocked mine. The toilet. Oh, great. Yes. It was big. <clears throat> so a little bit of an update. Mm-hmm. A few people may be interested. A lot of people may not be. But uh, we talked about a large poo that was left in the toilets here at the warehouse last week on the show. Yeah. We, uh, Keelan mm-hmm. was very amused by this poo. Not uncommon for Keelan to be thoroughly amused by a turd. Yeah. It is. I went into the bathroom this morning. Um, this, and this happened yesterday. Mm. So, oh yeah, you, you tell yours if you So, want. I went into the bathroom and there was the cleaner there. And I reckon I, I he, it gets cleaned once a week. It definitely needs to be done every day. Well, it doesn't. That's the thing. You were telling us that it gets cleaned once a week. Why? Well, I, I assume it does because it's, that sounds... We were talking about it last week, remember? Mm. There was that poo that was black. <laughs> yeah. Right? It wasn't, yeah. it, it wasn't brown. It wasn't... It yeah. was... Like, and it was definitely poo, by the way. It wasn't yeah. like... 
someone burnt their toast and shoved it in the toilet. It was definitely poo. I mean, it, it could have been tar. Yeah. <laughs> but, it de- but even if it was tar, it came out it, of a human. It looked like human bitumen. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> Not good. Not good. Yeah, you can, and you can probably take it out of the toilet, chuck it on a road, and then it'll be the smoothest ride ever. Now, we all know that Keelan thought this was very funny last week. We talked yeah. about it on the show, uh-huh. and I guess Keelan was accused of being quite immature. Mm-hmm. You would think after a week has passed... And you saw the same thing again. Often a joke is not funny twice, mm. let alone a poo. Yeah. Right? Because it's not even a joke. It's just a poo it's sitting in the a toilet. Just poo. Yeah. Uh, this is, I started recording Keelan as yeah. we walked into the toilet yesterday. And uh, just I love, look. just love that you're recording our employee in yes, the bathroom. in a bathroom. That's great. Well, There's no we, HR we here, have, clearly. Yeah. So, uh, and I was just going to say, I was like, Keelan, go in and check uh, if the yeah. poo is still there. And this is what happened. <laughs> You're taking a photo. You're disgusting. He took a photo. <laughs> a photo. Yeah. He just like, starts laughing uncontrollably. Well, show me then. Pulls out his phone and then just goes. <laughs> That's the <laughs> Gross, man. And you know when Killen's really amused and he does the silent mm. laugh? Yeah. So if, for those that don't know, sometimes you if we, you wouldn't even hear him because he's not in the shot. There it is. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> That's disgusting. He's doing it now. Ew. He does the silent laugh. He just goes. <laughs> That's it. Yeah. Oh, it makes me gag. It's so gross. <laughs> Why did you take a photo then? Because it's hilarious. <laughs> And that's all I wanted to talk about. All I wanted to point out was Keelan still finds this funny over a week on. He's already seen that poo before. That wasn't the first reaction. That's so funny. That's a poo that he knew was probably going to be there and he was still thoroughly entertained that's amazing. by the shit in yeah, the toilet. So today, this morning, yeah. I went I went in there to use the bathroom and the cleaner was in there. I've never seen someone look so sad. <laughs> like, if that's your job, like janitor, whatever, that's like a job. But warehouse janitor. Oh, yeah, no. He looked like devastated, and I came in, and I and I I really needed to go. I left. I was like, "You need to be alone to get through this. Uh, I don't <laughs> want to make your job harder." So, is it just um, one of the guys who works here, or is it they? No, do I they think, pay I someone? I think that's his only job, and he must do all the warehouses around here. Maybe like do. most people lay bitumen, he cleans it up. <laughs> Can um, we talk about the poo? <laughs> we need a poo update. Yeah, we do need to talk about a poo. No, a we're poo? on the. On the um, no, not Apu from The Simpsons, just Apu from the <laughs> warehouse. Yes. Uh, uh, while we're on the topic of this place being a hole, let's talk about the big poo this, in the hole. That's been there for three two weeks. To three weeks. Three weeks now. Isn't it's it three weeks? Three, it's got to be three weeks. Yeah, we've been talking about it on this show for at least two. <laughs> so for sure, it's been there for three weeks now. For some reason, Keelan, obviously, if you haven't listened, if you don't know, Keelan finds this poo hilarious he every time. He thinks it's the time. funniest thing he's ever seen. He will go pee three times a day, maybe, yep. and then laugh at the poo every single time. Every time. We just did it this morning. Yeah. yeah. He, he had goes, a look. He checks, he goes, oh, <laughs> still there. Yeah. <laughs> That's his life. He's <laughs> just it. checking in on that poo. So what he's uh, taken to is whenever we have a guest come in, uh, he, he takes them to the poo. <laughs> so it's, it's like one of the tourist attractions here. <laughs> <laughs> it really is. Man, have you seen the big poo? Have you it, seen the dog in a tucker box? What about the big poo? <laughs> it's like, oh, but like it's like the three things to do here are come watch the police raids, do a yep. bang, and come watch the big poo. Yeah, so we had Radio Mike over. I was doing some podcast stuff with him, yep. uh, and Keelan took him to the bathroom. Now, <laughs> I said, he was like, oh, man, you've got to look at the poo. And then I said, well, if you're doing this, you might as well film it. Yeah. Uh, and so Keelan's filmed Radio Mike's reaction to seeing the poo for the first time. I haven't heard this either. I decided to save it for the show. Uh, this is what Radio Mike thought of the poo. It's the poo is so thick that it's actually merged <laughs> with the water. There's no water. It's just like where you'd expect water to be. It's just solid, like an ice cube. <laughs> I just smelled it a bit. <laughs> a poo cube. It is. It's. It almost has solidified into a big poo cube. I love Mike's disbelief in that. He's like, this doesn't make sense. <laughs> He's right. There is no water yeah. left in the toilet. Oh, it's yuck. It's like the poo has absorbed all the toilet water. Yeah, it's <laughs> and gross. It's, just, it's like, I feel like it's growing like a monster, like a Scooby-Doo monster's going to Pretty sure it's going to merge with the toilet. There'll be no <laughs> difference between toilet and poo. <laughs> It'll just be like this thing in there that's yeah. slowly gaining sentience. It's going to look like a Digimon soon. <laughs> now, Keel, you filmed that. I did film that. Uh, you were editing that to 
to put in here, yeah. the shortened version, and you were uh, almost vomiting <laughs> looking at it. Uh, yes. So I was going to say we'll put the video in the Patreon because we can't post it anywhere because it's too gross. Do we want to do that? I think we should. Well, a Patreon poo exclusive. That's yeah. So we've just launched it, and the first thing we're going to post in there is a picture of a shit. <laughs> okay, I think... <laughs> You know what? You don't. Ha- they don't have to watch it. Let's post it. Give give people the option. Let's, okay, we're posting it. We'll put it in it's the secret Patreon exclusive. Section. An extended cut of Mike's reaction. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> cool. Extended Great. Cut. So if you love shit, <laughs> support us on Patreon. <laughs> it's just sugar. Should we talk about handle. poo? Hmm. Yes. <laughs> I think we should. Okay. Um, did that play? Yeah, that know, did play. My speaker was yeah. off. Um. It did play. We Just should... a quick poo update. Yeah. Uh, the, uh, so I went in oh, there. Oh, you've got an update. Yeah, to pee. Great. Uh, so the cleaner was in there this morning. Yeah. Uh, I actually saw the moment. I saw the look in his face. So he had his stuff, right? He went to check the one cubicle, the one without the poo. He went, all right. And I, saw he goes, he, I saw his mind go, that's achievable. And yeah, there's probably a little <laughs> shit stain on the back. Oh, you know? there's definitely a shit stain. Because there's never yeah. toilet brushes here. Yeah. So like, even if you do make a dent, it's going to be there until it gets clean. <laughs> yeah. Right? If you yep. make like a... So then he, and then he, he goes into the... Uh, what, what are we going to call that cubicle? Like... Uh, like Pubicle. <laughs> he goes into the pubicle. <laughs> and uh, I wanted to be like, oh, do you have a shovel? Because you're going to need a shovel. Cause oh, he's going to need a flamethrower. Yeah. At this point... <laughs> Like those stormtroopers, he's just gonna have to come he's gonna in, need, in a full hazmat suit and just torch the whole fucking place. Dude, he's gonna need like <laughs> he's gonna need to kill twenty five people in a row and hit it with a tactical nuke. <laughs> so I saw the moment he walked into the pubicle and yeah. uh, he just he just I, I clearly knew it was there yeah. because I saw him hesitate. He does what we do when we go look. We go like. Yeah, because you, kind of look. yeah, because <laughs> you want to look, but every time you see it, you go, what? so you have to like psych yourself I up. I could tell he knew it was there and he was like, has it, has someone dealt with it yet? And he went, and he just goes, <laughs> <laughs> it was the faintest sigh. Yeah. And he looked at me and I was like, Hey, and I kind of gave him like, uh, wasn't me. Look. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and, uh, I went to the urinal and then he, I feel like you could look at, if, if you're him, you could look at any one of us and be like, oh, obviously it wasn't them. Yeah, no. You can just tell the I type of I don't look like I could even be capable of what no. it is. No. And if you want to see it, it did get posted in the Patreon during the week. The secret sound We can't section. post a picture. It was like, post on Instagram. We're not posting a picture no way. of a tarmac-looking shit yeah, we'll on get, our Instagram. We'll get banned. We'll lose followers. Not everyone who follows us listens to the show. We're yeah, not putting it out there. Us, if you want it, it's in the secret sound off section, yep. all right? Go get it. Um, and I checked then half an hour later, he finished cleaning the toilets. Yeah. I was like, did he have a crack? Did he bring his shovel or yeah. did he bring a forklift an excavator? I don't know what he need. Mining equipment. There's no way. I see what he brings to work. He brings a spray <laughs> bottle, cloths, <laughs> like, and, a, and three different cleaning It's just things. like three Ajax products and a couple of chucks. It's absolutely not enough yeah, to, to handle that. It's just like, you do, you need to bring like a, one of those jackhammer things like just to get through it at this yeah. point and uh went went back and checked he uh all he did he shut the door <laughs> <laughs> so oh, that's good. he was like this will deal with it for now oh, and he just fuck. shut the door and i kicked it open and i was like oh that's still a that's poo. so funny he so just shut the door it's now been just on four weeks i think it's been right. a month now if you weren't listening to tuesday's episode we have promised uh killing and i wanted to try a flush <laughs> We wanted to see if a flush will work. Flush. And then uh, we decided on, look, if it's still there by Christmas, so yeah. in another six weeks, we will do a festive full flush. God, what a Christmas episode it's going to be. we got to put that on sports bet. Will the poo at the Luca Lewis warehouse <laughs> be clean? Honestly, that it's beyond a cleaner's job. That's a plumber's job now, for sure. Yes. That's not... Yeah. Anything that like a you, normal human can tackle, you, you need a certificate for. Yeah, you actually <laughs> to ta- to have to that. have been to TAFE yeah. and like and and, and learnt some skills yeah. to tackle that. Absolutely, you need to, you need to have literally seen some shit to tackle that. <laughs> yeah. Next week should be the full festive flush on the Christmas episode. Oh, is it? If we can't promise anything because yeah. we haven't been to the warehouse in like yeah. two weeks. If it's still there. If it's still there. Which it, which it. Oh. 
will, will be, be. <laughs> for sure. Confident. No one's doing it. Oh, I don't really want to do this festive I'm flush. I'm so excited. It's going to piss somebody off and for I, sure. Not me. Yeah, I know. Oh, come on, it's you all leave yogurt fall on in me. the shower. Yeah, but, but you're I, not afraid to flush a poo that's been there for four months. Yeah, but I don't pay rent here. <laughs> And, and and the people who own the hotel aren't like almost definitely Russian crime bosses. That's fine. Well, I think we can all agree. Yeah. We're less than a week away from the full festive flush. Mm-hmm. I'm excited. The people mm-hmm. listening are. Uh, maybe sound off below yeah. what you think about the festive flush. Predictions. What what do you think? This is the episode before the festive flush. So uh, is I reckon what will gonna, happen? I think it'll overflow. Only if we flush it twice, which... Well, it's not happening. Well... I was going to suggest on next week, but we can do it now. I, yeah. I was going to suggest it when Keelan was there because I know he'd back me in this. Yeah. I think it's only fair because we've all worked hard this year <laughs> and we all need a Christmas bonus <laughs> if we all do one half flush each. <laughs> Three festive flushes to signify well, a great year on the show. Well, no. If the Patreon doubles. Can we call Keelan? Now? If the Patreon doubles, another, we'll do another flush. No, no, no. Nah. <laughs> can I call Keelan? If, if he answers right now yeah. and gives it the okay, can we do three? No, I don't want to fucking flood the toilet. He might say no. He might say no. We cannot intentionally flood the toilet. We're intentionally Other do people it. Use We're trying that. to flush the toilet. We're trying to do them a favour. On it's camera a while flush. laughing and screaming it's a festive flush. for a podcast that will end ha- up somewhere. Do you know how many people we're going to piss off if we flood the fucking toilet? Everyone. Zach, it's fine. <laughs> Please pick up. It's part. It's well part. Oh, he's, mate, how are we? Good. So we're, we're currently doing the podcast right now. And right. you need to decide something for no, us. No, I don't like this. Yeah. <laughs> so we're yeah. talking about, obviously, next week, Christmas is on Wednesday. Uh, the Tuesday episode will be the full festive flush. Are you excited? Hey, Luke, can I break some news to you? <gasps> oh, no. The poo is gone. Oh, <laughs> no! Is it gone? Yeah. yeah, completely gone. There's no evidence that there was poo there. Any? Yeah, yeah, Someone beat oh. us to it. Do you reckon another yeah. podcast in the area did a pre-festive? Fuck! Flight? I'm devastated. <laughs> I think the janitor did his job. <laughs> That's so the guy insane. cleaned it. Oh, hang on. Yeah, yeah, completely cleaned it. What? The no. full festive flush. It's not going ahead. <laughs> That's wild. You told this. I'm, uh, mate. I'm devastated. Are you mourning at the moment? <laughs> yeah, definitely mourned. I can't I believe you didn't it. text us. Well, I did, in the group chat, I said, I'm not sure if I should tell you on the show or over the phone. Oh, you did oh. say I have some news for you all, and I ignored it. Because no. I was busy, I think. Yeah, yeah fuck. No, better for us to find out now, because we would have just seen it if we were there. Oh. Man, I'm devastated. Tomorrow's going to suck. I might cry. <laughs> I think we need to... Ne- you know what? Next episode, <laughs> we, need, <laughs> we need a... We need to hold the funeral for the f- warehouse poo. <laughs> we'll have to have a we'll have a memorial or something done yep. up. Uh, maybe guys, send us send in your 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 pay your respects to yep. the warehouse poo. If you want to make anything, put it in the Luke and Lewis subreddit. What if you have any messages for the yep. warehouse poo, post it in the subreddit. We can all mourn together because this is a dark time for the show. This isn't the end of an era. Mm. Like, I feel like this is the end of a saga. Like, this was uh, such a gripping mm. thriller on our show. And I didn't think it would end in a hotel room on the Gold Coast. <laughs> uh, so, this is very sad. Uh, we lost someone very close to the show. Sorry, Tom. You might cry. Um, the warehouse poo yes. uh, has fallen, has finally been cleaned. Uh, we don't good... know who cleaned it, what no. angel. <laughs> like, God. Like, look, I'm not religious, but mm. when Keelan yeah. told me that. The warehouse poo was finally gone. Yeah. I was like, maybe there is a higher power. Because I wouldn't fucking clean that oh, shit. A mere mortal could not defeat no. the power of no, the no, warehouse no. poo. Dude, even Thanos couldn't like click that shit away. Yeah. It was bad. Insane. A, a poo, we worked out, it's arrived in September and it just left in December. And I like that we're not even that's, using... That could have... That's almost three months. No, but it's like we're not even using the, the terminology now of like, oh, it was pooed. In September, it no. arrived. Oh yeah, like someone shipped it in. It, <laughs> There's like, no way it, it came, came out of a by human. freight. 
Like, <laughs> like they didn't delivered. even fly it in. A whole team delivered it in yeah. an ice box. Yeah. It was like it was like at a lab that ran out of money. They were like, we can't afford to keep it away from everyone else, so they yeah. had to dump it at some warehouse. It was, uh, and there it lived for three months. And <laughs> if you are new to the podcast, weird time to come because you missed a lot of this journey. But mm. this poo fascinated us. Originally, we just thought, wow. Someone dropped a hectic load. And then <laughs> we thought it would be gone the next day. That's pretty crazy. But then over the next few months, it became one of those Petri dish months. year nine science experiments where yep. we observed this uh, poo evolve and yep. it changed. It became uh, sentient. <laughs> yeah, but it, <laughs> We'd walk in and it would be like, good afternoon, Lewis Spears. <laughs> the weather is 26 <laughs> degrees. Yeah, it was like. What a, music would you like while you defecate? <laughs> <laughs> it's like yeah, yeah. it turned into Alexa. <laughs> <laughs> Warehouse yeah. poo, play Despacito. It did. It like and it it got yeah. smarter and it mm. learnt of us. It was pro it was AI by the end. Maybe it the just the US government had to shut it down. Maybe that's why it left. It just got so intelligent. It just left. It worked like that, out like how to movie, fuck off. Like that movie, her. It just evolved beyond uh -huh. human and just and just shot off into space to create its own civilization. Yeah. Godspeed, Warehouse poo. <laughs> Godspeed. But now that the explains why it's left. Because I yeah. watched the cleaner leave it there. Yo, yeah, he let we he came in every week. We, initially we thought there was no cleaner. That was the only thing that could be explained. But then we started to see the cleaner about once a week, which let's be honest, not often yeah. enough to come and clean the warehouse and then toilets. Keelan clearly. started concealing the poo. He started locking the toilet door. Oh, shall we do our favorite memories? Well, are no, you ready with the music? Yeah, I'm ready with the music. But when it started getting hot, the poo started to. Uh, harden, harden, and yeah. smell, solidify. And yeah, it yeah, cooked. Yeah, yeah. It cooked. And so I had to close the door, otherwise I couldn't fermented. use the toilet. It Not did. Good. It would have been alcoholic. You, like, <laughs> I'll, I'll, by the end, I wanted to get a straw. You know? <laughs> oh, oh. Yuck. I'm sorry. Which button am I pressing, Keely? The one next to the theme song. This one. Okay. Right. Are we gonna do some of our favourite? Yeah, memories? I think it's time to share our favourite warehouse poo <gasps> memories to pay our respects before we begin the episode. Gone, but not forgotten. Would you like you to go, go first? first? Or should I'll oh. go first? It's just I thought you I'll were go first. Go okay, first. my favorite memory with uh, the warehouse poo, rest his soul. Uh, <laughs> their soul, don't mean to misgender the warehouse poo, however they identify, I respect it. Uh, <laughs> my favorite memory was, was walking in on month two, the end of month two, almost month three of the warehouse poo's existence. Everyone was aware of it. Everyone in the warehouse must know about it. The cleaner definitely knew about it. My favorite memory was walking into the bathroom when the cleaner was there and checking to see if the poo was still there, seeing that it was still there going, ha <laughs> and then looking at the cleaner, and the cleaner gave me this look like, is this guy going to tell me to clean it? And I didn't tell him to clean it, and I looked away, and I saw the relief in the cleaner's eyes, and then he left it there for another month. Yep. <laughs> and that's very amusing. Yep. That, that, and I that's don't a blame good memory. him. It's a fond mm. memory. Yeah. And it's times like like when you lose, you know, something or someone's one. yeah, loved I one. I love poo. Uh, you kind of you don't you don't get sad at obviously what's gone. You remember the good times. It's and the beauty of life. Yes, and that's why I'd like to share my favorite memory mm -hmm. of the warehouse poo. Yeah, uh, circle was, of digestion moves on. <laughs> my favorite memory of the poo was actually my first yeah. memory with the poo. Yeah, funnily enough. Uh, Keelan and I were there yeah. and uh, I've never seen a man <laughs> laugh harder at good. anything yeah. than I have Keelan laughing at that poo. <laughs> and I think it shows what was great about the poo and it's why the poo has a lot of fans in this podcast because yeah. the joy that it brought people. <laughs> <laughs> it really did bring people together. That was the number one question asked yes. after every show is, is the warehouse poo still there? And it How's was, he doing? I think it, it made, was well, there. We didn't know. We were on tour when mm. the poo was uh, obviously shot into space. Yeah. Uh, so that was so my favourite memory regret, of the poo. I just, I just, was, uh, I just didn't get to say goodbye. It, it is. It was. <laughs> not Look, this is obviously. Because obviously today yeah. we were going to do a full festive flush. Mm. This is our that festive episode. Plan. Christmas Eve today. And we just went. Christmas is ruined. Christmas is ruined. Yeah. I feel like um, the poo is. Uh, All the listeners at home don't celebrate. Oh, it's kind of like uh, early, you know, past Scrooge, mm. bit of a humbug. Keelan, would you like to share your favourite memory? And then I have one one thing to ask of the listeners. My favourite memory was watching Radio Mike get some soup, not uh, soap, sorry, <laughs> and uh, 
put the soap on the poo to disinfect it. He that did. Was, <laughs> he, uh, that was good. he squirted about four squirts on yeah. there and yeah. I don't think... And then almost vomited. I don't think it helped no. either. I don't think there's any way to disinfect yeah. what was in that toilet That's bowl. what gave it the extra chemicals was... needed to become sentient, I think. Yeah. Well, that's a great memory. Are you okay? <laughs> you just tuned out. <laughs> no, I'm okay. He's, he's sad. Just, he's, he's grieving, sad. He's right? Grieving. Sorry. Everyone you grieves differently. One, one last thing to ask the listeners. If you are at home, if you're at the office, I would like you to stand up, stop doing what you're doing, <laughs> and move to the bathroom. I'll give you 30 seconds. Yeah. Because we can't do a festive flash here. Or if, or if you're on the train <laughs> yeah. right now, yeah. Uh, get off the train at get the next the train, stop. Go to the public bathroom. Yep. You can have a minute. <laughs> I would like, on the count of three... And also, if your boss says, why were you late? If you're, on the way, if you're currently yeah. on your way to work, uh, tell them, firstly, fuck off, it's Christmas time, yeah. I don't want to be here. Yeah. And then tell them, uh, I lost a loved one this, this is morning. A, this <laughs> this <laughs> is a national day of mourning, how dare you? Yeah. Um, why were you on time? Say that. Yeah. Uh, in, in three seconds, I would like you to all flush your toilets full at once. Three, two, one, festive flush. Goodbye, warehouse poo. Gone, but not forgotten. Yep. I will always remember your smell. Yes. <laughs> Before we move on, yeah. I had an actual theory of how it got away. This yeah. is this is another theory. Obviously, probably in mm -hmm. rocket somewhere or, or it evolved. Yeah. I reckon they replaced the toilet. You think? I reckon it was so blocked yeah. up. It's a new toilet. I thought the same thing as well. Actually, Have we looked at the toilet? I reckon I, it might be it new. Is, but it looks like it. I just remember thinking when looking at it, going. There's no way you can fix this. That's it's a, that's that a permanent a, blockage. It was cement. It's cemented. Horrible. Yeah. It's either that or a pressure hose and a nuke. Well, if we're yeah. being fair, mm. uh, there was one time that Radio Mike did urinate on it and it was quite... Did he? Mike really got interactive with the one that's proof. <laughs> it was, <laughs> not very, not very it was, after that, it became squishy and soft. <laughs> Yuck. So maybe... Like with a brain. Because didn't you say at one point, like, for a thousand dollars... Tom's cringing <laughs> listening to this. He hasn't even seen the poo. <laughs> but didn't... Do you have the photo on your phone? I do. Show Tom. Didn't you say at Tom one point that for a thousand dollars you'd mush it up mm -hmm. with, a, with a spoon? Okay, this is enough, all can right? I, but wait, can I just continue with One more, theory? and then we've got to get into the episode. It's going to be a very long episode. I think after he flushed... Uh, he, he weighed on it, yeah. it became um, moist enough that with a plunger you could just push it down the pipes... Keelan is almost vomiting just thinking about it. Guys, it's time to end here. <laughs> so now, <laughs> we just had a dry reach from yeah. Tom, who's walked in. Yeah. Um, and uh, what what was a beautiful moment on the show and a national day of mourning has mm. now turned into four grown men looking at a poo on Keelan's phone. <laughs> Fuck off.